Hi, I'm Tony Johnson from Grunfoss Pumps. I'm here today in Hillbank, South Australia, talking to Peter about the installation of the Scala 2 pressure pump. So Peter, tell us why you chose to install the Scala 2 pressure pump. Well, with the pump being so close to the house, the noise of the existing pump stopping and starting all the time was a major issue. After speaking to our Grunfoss dealer, they recommended the Scala 2, and with a 2 plus 2 year warranty, it gave us extra peace of mind. So Peter, what are you using the pump for? Well, at the moment, we're just using it for garden irrigation, but with it being a, a variable speed pump, we can now investigate the use for flushing the toilet and also laundry use. The new Grunfoss Scala 2 is a robust self-priming pump set to be a game changer in domestic boosting across Australia and the world. With its long list of features and benefits, the Scala 2 is the perfect solution for homeowners and pump installers alike. The Scala 2 adjusts performance according to water demand, providing constant pressure to all taps regardless of variation in demand or inlet pressure. The Scala 2 features a permanent magnet motor to help reduce power consumption by up to 40% over conventional pumps. To protect the pump and help ensure a long life, the Scala 2 includes a range of protective features. For those living in areas of poor power supply or those who are sometimes affected by power outages, the Scala 2 can also be run on a generator. Another unique benefit of the Scala 2 is its quiet operation thanks to the permanent magnet motor and water cooling technology. The Scala 2 suits most domestic pressure boosting applications, including pressure boosting from above ground rainwater tanks pressure boosting from below ground water sources including below ground tanks and dams. Mains boosting for those living in areas with insufficient mains pressure. The Scala 2 is quick and easy to install. It only takes three steps. To install the pump, you'll need the following tools. Teflon tape, a pipe wrench, and depending on existing fittings, you may need a shifter. The first thing to do when installing a pump is to carefully read the pump manufacturer's operation and instruction manual that is supplied with the pump. Check any local regulations that may apply before installing. Check there is an isolation valve on the outlet of the tank and there is an isolation valve on the discharge of the pump. It is recommended that you install an isolation valve to the discharge of the pump to help with any fault finding later on. First, apply the Teflon tape to the fittings. Connect the suction pipework to the pump and connect the discharge pipework to the pump also. Next, prime the pump. You'll need approximately 1.7 litres of water. Finally, plug the pump into the power outlet. Turn on a tap to vent in the air out the system. Turn it off to make sure there's no leaks and the pump switches off. Another great feature of the Scala 2, it doesn't need a pump cover. And it's a great looking pump, so why would you want to cover it up? For further information on the pump and to contact your local dealer, go to grunfoss.com.au slash Scala 2.